we have to fight those wild winds to find that, that calm in the storm and adapt to the changes around us. This is especially true for the ministry that you all are doing, cross-racial, cross-cultural. If you don't adapt today, our churches will continue to die. But some of us so badly want to return to the way things used to be. We don't want to get in that boat. Do I have to go? Please don't make me go. Those people over there, I don't know them. They don't speak my language. They don't look like I do. They don't smell like I do. I, 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 don't make me go, Jesus. We have to get to the other side. The people are waiting. Our communities have changed. The world has changed. What was does not exist anymore. The people are waiting. We have to create a new reality, a new way of being. This doesn't mean giving up. It means we actually deepen our work. It means we take bold steps and exercise our wildest imagination because even in our own wildest imagination, we cannot out-imagine God. 